A gift gone bad, a Brownsville woman wanting to do something nice left paying for something broken. She called five on your side for help. Channel 5's John Paul Barajas answered that call. The gift was a brand new fridge. She told us when they brought it home, it never worked. So she wanted the store to do the right thing so her act of kindness wouldn't turn into a huge waste of money. Anything for the kids. When a godmom of three found out her loved ones were struggling at home with a bad fridge, she came to the rescue. Those kids, what can I say? They were basically born here. I'm the godmother of the three kids she has, so I said, well, I'll go and give them one. Isidora Villarreal admits she's not rich, but helps where she can. She bought a brand new fridge to end the family's struggles, but that's not what happened. You buy something and then it doesn't work. And you go and return it, and they give you a new one, but not here. When her new fridge showed up, it never got cold, according to Villarreal. A simple fix, she thought, but she was told there would be no new fridge. Why? Why didn't they cancel the purchase? It's so easy. They have millions of fridges and can send me one instead of making me wait. After nearly a month without a fridge, General Electric employees came out to fix it. The fridge is finally working, but that's not their biggest concern. Villarreal says she didn't pay for a brand new fridge just to have it repaired. If we already started bad, brand new, it breaks once. I have a year of using it. It'll most likely break more. We reached out to General Electric about her concerns. They told us they have had a language barrier issue with Villarreal, but are now working with a bilingual support team to find a solution. Villarreal is in communications with General Electric. We'll let you know how they ultimately resolve the issue. In the studio, John Paul Barajas, Channel 5 News at 6.